Rory. Good to see you. Good to see you. Good to see you. These are my belts here. I'm going to have to carry the one that he carries. Make a little bit more space. Make a little bit more space. Make a little bit more space. Make a little bit more space, please. George, do it first. Got to talk about uh, all the love, man, you're getting from all your uh, Australian and nice. Nice. Because, uh, let's get it, everyone take a big step back for me, please. Yeah, it's, it's beautiful. It's amazing. I, I'm very uh, embraced by all of it. And I know when I step inside on Sunday, there's already nearly 45, if not more, thousand tickets already gone. Still got a few more days. So this thing is going to ramp right up all in my corner. Every bit of them I will feel on Sunday. And Devon Haney will feel it as well. George, why will you win on Sunday? I'll do everything better. Victor by any means. I'm ready to go whatever way in that fight. He's not ready for a dog fight. He wants to box, no, no worries. He wants to brawl, no worries. Whatever he wants, we're ready. Biggest fight in Australia news. How do you feel about what, you, what you've done? Georgie? It's, it's a nice feeling, but you know me. I bet here for my lopers. I'm back in the gym straight away. I'm never content. So all this is cool, but I love to fight. My passion is fighting. That, that's that's where that hunger is. I love to fight, so bring on Sunday. George, so how can you fight? You're not sure you're uh, feeling any obligation to possibly look for a knockout, make sure to please your fans and see Victory by any means. Victory, whatever way, I'm ready. If he wants to do 30 rounds, if he wants to do until someone quits, whatever way, I'm ready. How do you feel you've gotten better since the two of you the Bigger, stronger, faster, sharper, in my prime right now. I was not in my prime for the Lopez fight. What they saw is is not even half what I brought to the table and what I bring to the table now. So much better, and I'm at home now. I'm backed by my, by my people now. The so second, yep. What are his weaknesses? George? Everything. You Look, he's a good boxer. I'm not going to disrespect him, but I'm an elite boxer. We've seen it before, and we'll show it again and again and again. So many holes. I will I will land my shots. I'll land them clean with bad intentions. Every shot that I land. Second half from the UK. What are you going to say to the Greek fans in the UK? I know there's a lot of uh, fans in the, in the UK. I was fortunate enough to fight uh, Lee Selb in the UK, so it was behind closed doors, a bit different to this now, but um, I felt the love there as well, so hopefully we get to come there and fight there one day again. George, what does this mean for boxing in Australia? This is huge. This is the biggest in, in Australian boxing. So to be able to give the blueprint for a young amateur or, or aspiring professional to make sure that they can see this, say, you know what, I can do that as well, because let's, let's be frank, I was... Never backed, never supported, didn't have many behind me. So at the end of the day, this is the adversity I have to go through. And now these young kids coming up, and there's a lot of good talent in our country, can get there as well. And uh, I will do whatever I can to support them as well. George, you sacrificed so much for five years, fighting mm. in everyone else's backyard. You finally got to come home and get a taste of the hero's welcome you're going to get on Sunday. How does it feel, mate? Does it lift you up? Does it energize you? Uh, it's motivating, it's aspiring, and uh, I'm humbled by it. That's This is just a small bit of what's to come on Sunday. And how are you taking on the new role of a role model in Australian boxing, transcending the sport to all of sports in Australia? How are you taking on that role? I embrace it. I embrace all of it. And uh, my confidence, my will to fight, my hunger will show all these young kids that they can do it as well. And I pray they do it as well. George, there was a feeling you got lucky against Lopez that you could be a one-hit wonder. Do you want to erase all those doubts? No problem. If that's what they believe, that's what they think, then uh, let's see the excuses after this fight because I'm sure there'll be many who want to take out Devin Haney. George, what do you think about uh, Devin Haney's chair? I heard he made comments about Renata's touching him, uh, Jojo mm. touching him. What, what do you make of this chair? Well, let's see on Sunday when I land flush on him. Let's see how much he can take of it. Let's see how brave he is. Let's see how tough his corner is. Does his corner really love him? Let's see because that's a whole brand new corner. Let's see if they really love him. Has he got your heart, George? No, think? no. He does not have my heart. We all saw it. He posted it this morning. He's a, he, I'm there explaining my story. I've been asked to explain my story. And he, he got frustrated and upset about my story because he's had the easy road. He has not gone through adversity. So you know what? He'll feel it on Sunday, the adversity I've had to go through. I'll show him firsthand. Yes. How do you guys feel? He was going behind. See if my is back. So it is what it is. It's there. He's lucky I haven't put it out there. I might put it out today if I feel like it, but it is there. So he knows deep down, and I saw it in his eyes when we faced off, that inside, he knows what he did. He, he turns around um, to me about uh, Jeff Horn and Pacquiao. That's sparring. I got, half my team is American. I've got American sparring partners. All the, Amer all the Australian sparring partners he used, they're not rats. They're helping him out. I'll give him my blessing.
my American team have my blessing. So it's a whole different story when you go around on Twitter sending messages and make first contact with the enemy. It is what it is. Sunday will be found out. Oh, I'm here in the room. I so, say, uh, wow, have to wait and see. If the great Manny Pacquiao, the legend, rocks up to support me, yes, I, 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 uh, if he's here, it's going to be amazing. I'm just having fun. Yeah, I didn't get too uh, entrenched in all that. He's the one that's upset and, and frustrated and uh, I've ruffled a lot of feathers. So that's on him. For me, I'm, this is the same Cambosis we saw in the Lopez fight, in the Sorby fight, in the Mickey Bay fight. It's the same Cambosis. So if he's upset, if he is, if he isn't, I'm cool, calm, collected. I'm enjoying every moment of this. Just have a couple more, guys. A lot of versus one through three out of your yes. career. You know, here at home, you feel any pressure at all since you've been fighting a lot of breakups? No pressure. Never, never no pressure. I'm blessed to be here. I really shouldn't even be here. Let's be, let's be serious. This, I was never meant to get here. I was a 13 to one underdog in the Lopez fight. I was underdog in the Selby fight. Underdog in every fight that I've gone into. And again, I'm the underdog. But you know what? This top top dog will still stay at the top after this fight. Fighters don't like to think ahead once the you know, fight comes around. But provided that you win Sunday, you know, big names are out there. Any names that you're specifically looking at? All of them. All of them. But I'm focused on Devin Haney. That's first. Thanks guys. Thank you guys. Thank you guys. Thank you for making the effort to all come and thank you to all the Americans as well coming out for supporting. It's amazing, man. It's amazing. Best fight of the best. Back to back to back to back. I've proven it.